All right, y'all. What's up, what's up? It's another episode of your boy, the Brent Taylor Show, and I'm back with Bugatti, yo. Special guest. What's going on, bitch? Y'all know who he is. Boo Capone. Uh, Boo for Rick, Ah, uh, yeah. Boo Pop. Don Boozy Miguel. Yeah, Boo, Boo Kelly. That's one of my favorite ones. Yeah, Boo Kelly. You know. Boo Cosby. Yeah, Boo Cosby. Uh, Boo Belafonte. What's one that people actually know you as? I, you know. You have so many aliases. I don't think it. The Heckler. That's one of them. But, you know, if, if the most famous, the most thing be a, you did, uh, probably Boo Capone. Because that's, out of that thing, you made a lot of money. You know what I'm saying? It started a lot. That's of, what you most know as Boo Capone, huh? Yeah, but Boo Heffers, you know, that's the one that, you know. But see, because when I started, you know, when I was Capone, Boo, they stole it, you know. So they somebody stole. else was Boo Capone, too, no, or somebody first, else was, you was the first? I was the first Capone, if it was Boo or if it was... You know, it was Boo Capone. I was you were the, the first, first Capone? Capone. And yeah. the first Boo? Because I, I, I see these rappers now. There's other Boos. Yeah. And there's other Capones. Come on, man. Right? Yeah. And I can tell you, out of, my, out of New York. I mean, it was, we did a show in San Diego. With my, shout out to my nigga, uh, Intelligent Hudlum. You know, he'll tell you. He said Capone, no regular. Capone wouldn't even call himself Capone back then. Until my nigga, uh, Intelligent Hudlum, we uh, pockets, we shot, everybody paid back. We got into a big old thing. Yeah, but people I don't know. No, we got into a big old thing back there then, and Intelligent Hudlum was there. Intelligent Hudlum? Yeah, yeah. Gaddafi, my nigga, one of the coldest niggas out of Queens. He's responsible for the, all the niggas out there. LL Cool J put him on when he was 15. Hey, I'm sorry, you named like 17 niggas just now. Is yeah. Intelligent Hoodlum Gaddafi, or is are these two different people? These the same people. That we just call his name. You know, it's Intelligent Hoodlum. You got Gaddafi, and you know. Uh, LL is cool that J. what? And LL Cool J. Well, LL Cool J signing when he was like fifteen. He got a Queens man. You know, he's a bunch of just, but you know Nas Queens Bridge all that shit. That's them. Oh my god. Yeah. So okay, I'm trying to follow rap with you. You're yeah. saying that the outlaws, the niggas that rap with Tupac, no, is the goons. <laughs> Nah, my nigga. Gaddafi. No, no, no. Not Signed that with LL Cool J, nigga? Not that Gaddafi. See, you're young. You don't know the touch of the hood, You know, he was, signed, he was a rapper since he was 15. But, but to make a long story long, um, yeah, we got into it with him. And then, you know, he, Capone, you did your thing. Capone, you did. I think, you know, take it back to New York. The next thing I know, people calling themselves Capone. You know, but it was all great. We can do the, the lineage or the timing. Or, I can Google this? You can, I mean, just do the timing. Do the history. All you got to do is, you know. But at the end of the day, there's a lot of bulls. I'm an innovator, man. Like when I did Boo Half, I came with Boo Half. Niggas was calling himself Half now. You got yeah, that from yeah. Hugh Half, nigga. But I, let me tell you something. I, I, You're the, the ghetto, original thief. I'm the ghetto Boo Half. It's called a metaphor. You grab, you was calling yourself Brent Trump. I didn't say nothing back to you. You got Capone listen, from Al Capone. You, man, listen, you know, it's a metaphor. You be gangsters. It was a metaphor of my music. It's a metaphor how I get down. You know what I'm talking about? Boo being blessed, open and optimistic. Capone being a gangster that he was. We admired that. America, my, they made movies about these people, man. You know what I'm talking about? So it, cool. we, it was a metaphor of what my lyrics are, of what I, what I do. Thank you.